Have a good day, Joe. Bye. Bye. He's feeling better, but we're going to let him stay home and rest one more day. He's still, uh, you know, certainly not 100%. You ready to go, Johnny? Yep. All right, I am too. Let's head out of here. Ooh, look at how bright and shiny Ruby is this morning after her bath. Please, please let everything be dry and her stay nice and clean today. Good morning, Ruby. Hey, Donnie, did you get your paper? Yes, ma'am, I sure did. Thank you for making Ruby so pretty. Oh, well, pretty girl, two pretty girls going out the other need to be going on. Mm. Mm, pretty girl, I love pretty you. Yeah. You go read your paper. Bye, yeah. Mr. Relax Bye. for a few minutes. Yeah. Um. Boy, it sure is good to see the sun rise this morning and some color in the sky again. It seems like it's been days. Yep, it's pretty out there this morning. Today we have a picture of an old farmhouse. Uh, it's not too far from uh, our house in Fuquay. It's over in Willow Springs. Unfortunately, it currently stores hay, which is a little sad. Uh, the family had given me permission to go up and uh, take pictures. And um, I stylized this photo a little bit and presented a picture, a copy of this picture back to the family. So hopefully they have a good feeling about photographers and letting people film this uh, beautiful old farmhouse. Have a good day, Johnny. I love you. I got him here just a little late. Not too late, though. All right, I'm back at the scene of the fire ant crime this morning. I promised myself I would only talk about the fire ants one time today, so here you go. Um, I'm really swollen up where they bit me. That happens every time I get bit. I always get bit taking pictures. That's just the way it is. Um, I found it really hard to believe that I got bit yesterday because I thought I was only on asphalt. So I wanted to come check and see what I missed. And sure enough, if I look down at the ground right there on the very curb near this tree, there's the fire ant mound. Yeah, so I'm not gonna talk about it again, but you know, I'm gonna be miserable for quite some time. My fingers and my ankle are very swollen and um, it's uncomfortable and I'm gonna have a good day anyway because that's who I am. So I had ordered this uh, quote unquote decorative window film for the garage door window. It's a floral print with some blue tones that match the door and um, I'd ordered it from Home Depot and it's available for pickup today. I did a online to store order so I'm gonna go grab it. inflatables always have to check them out so Saturday November 11th marked the start of the Cornell lab um, ornithology project feeder watch bird watching count I've been doing this for God at least 10 years where I spend uh, approximately an hour every week monitoring the birds at our bird feeder and then providing the citizen science um, count back up to a project feeder watch so we have a lot of squirrels and we don't like to waste bird food on the squirrels but this red hot pepper suet does a really great job of feeding the birds and uh, not feeding the squirrels and i'm almost out so i'm going to get some while i'm here at home depot 
So it's not too late to sign up for Project Feeder Watch for this season. I think it's like $17 a year membership fee, something like that for non-Cornell um, Lab of Ornithology members. Um, that suet that I got, all the woodpeckers like it. Cardinals, Carolina wrens, black cap chickadees, tufted titmouse, blue jays. I mean, everybody eats that stuff. So, and when it's fresh and it's really got the pe red hot pepper in it, the squirrels really don't like it. Every once in a while, a squirrel comes along <laughs> that doesn't have any taste buds, but mostly it's pretty pretty cheap uh, at a dollar fifty a suet cake, and um, also pretty effective at only feeding the bird birds. Not that I'm against the squirrels, but you know, hey, we got all those trees in the yard with all those nuts. Go eat the nuts. The town of Fuquay is uh, getting their Christmas decorations up. Those flags are new. I don't remember those from last year. It's a reindeer. Pretty cool. They have put up these uh, flag Fuquay Verena. Um, flags. <laughs> These red, white, and blue flags with Fuquay Verena on them just before Veterans Day, which was really nice. Usually they're up for 4th of July. Um, so yeah, those are coming down and the Christmassy reindeer ones are going up apparently. It's uh, 48 and quite breezy out there this morning. When I walked into Home Depot, it was, uh, you know, I was glad to get back inside the store, but that's because I'm doing that. I don't need a jacket thing today. Yeah, don't like jackets unless I really, really need them. Bye, Donnie. Bye, sweetie. All right, I'll see you this afternoon. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I'm going to pick up Johnny, but after, I, you know, I'm going to shop afterward. If for some reason that isn't going to work, I'll call you. Okay, well, I'll have a little surprise for you when you get home. Oh, yeah, that's right. My window film, huh? <laughs> yes, your window film. Oh, another surprise, too? No. That was all the surprise it was. Oh. You spoiled it. You could have said, oh, look at my surprise, but no. <gasps> really, Donnie, a surprise? What could it be? Oh, uh, you'll have to wait and see. Okay, I'll look forward to it. Love you. Bye. So it's almost 1030, and I'm on my way to meet Michelle. Yeah, we meet at 1030, but, you know, I have this <laughs> habit of uh, always running about five minutes late, so... She loves me anyway, just like Donnie. Um, yeah, she's not going to be able to shop with me the whole day, I don't think. I think she said something about a Little Mermaid thing coming out at the Disney store today that she has to have. So she's headed over to Crabtree this afternoon to get in line for that, I guess. Some limited edition thing. She'll have to send me a picture of it. But, you know, uh, she loves mermaids and her daughter's Ariel. So, you know, and Disney all comes together. It's a thing. Um, but we're going to meet up at Guardian Angel. I've got her puppy gate in the back. And I've also got a bunch of bags and glass for our farm people that deliver our uh, farm order to Whole Foods. Uh, new pasture farms. So I got a lot of stuff in the back right now. I'm trying to help clean up the corner of the garage. I think, you know, we were up to having like, you know, 30 or 40 paper bags over there. And then the farm folks, they'll reuse them. So a lot of them are already doubled. We try to reuse ours. You know, Whole Foods will give you 10 cent a bag if you bring back the paper bags. And I try to do that every week because <laughs> I don't, Donnie asks me about it. So I'm saying this so I can remember lots of bacon today. I decided I'm going to fix the we don't have enough bacon at the house like we've run out and I'm in trouble thing because we can freeze a couple of pounds of it. So I'm going to buy enough to replenish the refrigerator and then I'm going to outbox myself and I'm going to put some in the freezer too. <laughs> First world problems, I realize. So besides the reindeer, there's a red season's greetings wreath flag and also a bell flag. And I'm thinking that the town also always has up a lighted wreath or angel or something on all of the poles too so uh, they got a bit more work to do but they're getting the flags up for right now good morning miss star wars yep i wanted to wear my new necklace oh way cool oh it's the solar system and star wars stuff way <laughs> cool way cool so i got your gate and your blanket and the sweatshirt and like a do new dog toy gift oh and some other stuff but let's deal with that after we shop. <laughs>
<laughs> so here's uh, what Michelle's headed to get at the Disney store up at Crabtree at around 12. She said 12 to 1, so good luck. I really wish this was my size, but it's not. Bummer. Well, that's an exciting find for me. Six lunch plates and six dinner plates. A Corel pattern I've never seen before. That'll look really great in the fall. All right, girl. I wondered where you got lost at. What'd you find? I thought this would look good on my daughter. Uh-huh. Okay. Dress her up a little bit. Dress her up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, look what I found. Oh, look. And it matches. It sure does. <laughs> look at that. That's too cool. <laughs> Maybe I can get one of the guys at the house to wear this. <laughs> So Michelle was explaining to me that the way the Disney store does this is you get uh, walk up and you get a ticket between 12 and 1 and then at 1 o'clock they draw n number of tickets and then those people actually get to make the purchase. Wow. So um, I'm actually headed up to Crabtree with Michelle so I can get a ticket and increase her chances of getting this item. And um, she's following me to Whole Foods and then gonna hop in my car. We'll go to Crabtree, we'll grab Johnny. I'll drop her back off at Whole Foods to go on and get Ariel and Connor while I go in and do my shopping. So yeah, I think it's gonna work out good. We'll get to spend a little extra time together. There it is. Oh wow, we got to show our ID and everything, huh? Yeah. So it's official, all official. Stuff, you know. Really? Okay. <laughs> no harm in looking at Build-A-Bear, right? We're just looking, just looking. But the turkey, he's so cute. Well, Crabtree is almost ready for Santa. Give you, I'll give you two trivia questions. Oh boy. Okay. I'm terrible at trivia. I forget oh, every, I forget every. You'll be fine. Okay. Uh, how about I'll give you one easy one and one hard one? Okay. Okay. But as long as I still win. <laughs> I, think, I think you're good. <laughs> Something tells me you're good. Okay. All right. You ready? Uh-huh. So, Sebastian uh -huh. sings a song. Uh-huh. Something is always greener. Is always what? Something oh, is always greener. Greener. Oh, yeah. It's um, under the sea, right? But, What's um, always greener? Yes. The there you, you got it! Yay! Yay. Yay. <laughs> oh, but she's only she's only done one I trivia question. What color is Ariel's hair? No. Oh. <laughs> no, I know. I gave her a little bit more challenging than that. <laughs> Even I know that one. <laughs> Okay, you ready for the next one? Okay. This one is kind of easy too. Okay. okay. So in the beginning, uh huh. So when King Triton rides in on his chariot, yes. who pulls him? It's that little seahorse guy. Nope. Huh? Nope. No, it's not the seahorse. King Triton. King oh yeah. Triton. Right, King not Triton. Not Sebastian. Right, not Sebastian. King Triton. He's not the bigger one. Right. Comes in on dolphins. I know it's dolphins. Oh, okay, dolphins. Dolphins. Okay, okay, you ready? Let's draw. Uh. Film at 11. Film at oh 11. <laughs> All right, no trip to Crabtree would be complete without a quick peek into the Lego store. But I'm still looking at BB 8. Well, that might be a ruby color, but that is not a ruby. Michelle and I can agree with that motto. Hilarious. Just hilarious. shopping time has come to an end. We have to go adult now. <laughs> we have to get the kids. The kids, no! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Are we early? What do you think of my carpool, Michelle? <laughs> I, I think we're early, right? Are no, we like two hours no, earlier? we're. It's been going for five minutes. What? Yeah, that's all the cars there are. But it's not onto the road, like no, the it's not. There's nobody beeping. No, it's not. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> Uh, you can put it on top of the bags. Just set it on top of the bags. What? Not the blue bag. Not Miss Mich There you go. Good job, buddy. It's been awkward. Hey. <laughs> it's Sorry. Be careful with Whole Foods. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How's your day, bud? Pretty good. Yeah. So I actually have good news. What's that? Remember Mr. Abernathy? Uh huh. I got in contact with him and got Joey's makeup work for him. Oh, well, oh. Joey will be thrilled about that. <laughs> Today, Mr. Abernathy told me he, Joey needs to see him tomorrow. Okay. We'll see you later. Oh, bye. Thanks for letting me tag along to the mall. Well, thank you for taking me. Yeah. <laughs> I had a great time. Yeah, me you too. Know. <laughs> so, Whole Foods Carry has a new thing called Amazon Locker. And uh, the sign says you can do get deliveries or make returns here. So that's pretty cool, especially like the returns part. I know I saw an article this week that said that Kohl's was going to start accepting Amazon returns so that they could get more foot traffic in the store, that people prefer to return items in person instead of mailing them back in. So interesting. Thanks for taking the carts back, Johnny. <laughs> Fun. Two well, most of the wheels are broken. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're all loaded up again and ready to go home. Johnny really is a good kid. Well, Donnie did get the window film installed on the door and I really like it. That is so cool. Way cool. So, I've gone 105 miles today. Shows I have 116 miles of range, estimated range left. I'm in the driveway now and um, the car was making some gurgling noises after I pulled up. I'm sure it has to do with the heat running and I'm just not used to the heat running, but uh, interesting. So I was reading the paper today and look what I found for you and Ruby. Parking deck yields some artsy surprises, and yep. it's got a lion mural there. Yeah, it says that there's going to be 44 works from 27 local teenage artists um, over the next few years. At uh, They'll stay up for a period of time, and then they'll replace them period. And where is it at? North Hills Mall Parking Deck. So where the supercharger right is in Raleigh. Supercharger. Way cool. I'll definitely be checking them out. Yep. Hey kitty, how are you? Well, I'm home and we've got all of the groceries in the house and put away. And poor Johnny is in here struggling with his math homework. Yeah, he had like 40 problems to do over a two night period and it's this pre-algebra stuff. So I'll be helping him in a little bit. And um, Joey's uh, seems to be doing better. Obviously not 100%, but I'm, I'm thinking uh, good enough to go to school tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs>